This is a Chesapeake Bay Blue Crab. If you've seen some of our other videos, you probably saw us catch this crab and cook it. But in those videos, I didn't have time to sit down and actually show you how to pick one of these things. So that's what I'm going to do right now. What do you need? You need the crab, you need a knife, and uh, well, a natty bow. So I'm going to strap on the GoPro for a first hand experience. We're going to get to picking. And the lighting would have been better outside, but my neighbor just started cutting his grass. So we're going to do it in here. Alright, this is a male. You can see by his thingy. Claw, you break that off and there's some uh, some delicious meat right there. Now to get into the claw, you go right about here, take your knife, give it a light whack and then a twist. And then from there, your meat should come out. Now there's a piece of cartilage in here, so when you bite it, you just pinch it. And you leave that there. And that's how he uh, he can get you. Now there's a little bit of meat in there. I will get to that. But for the sake of the video and time, there's this side. It's the same thing. You just bite it with your teeth and pull it out. And there's a little bit of cartilage in there. But this here, that's all meat. That's going in the dumpster. So all the other stuff that doesn't come out, you fish out with your knife. The reason I'm showing this video is because not everybody respects these creatures and knows how to eat them properly. And uh, I've seen people just crack them open, go for the back fin, rip that out, eat that, and throw the rest away. And it's upsetting to uh, to me. Take a leg. Now there's meat in the leg. You pop this little piece here off. And now I like to bite these with my teeth, but you can bite this with your teeth and sort of work that there into your mouth. And the leg meat, especially on uh, bigger crabs, is quite plentiful and it's extra sweet. So I'll show the camera how to do that with my teeth. Like this. And you work that in your mouth. Absolutely delicious. Now, to get in this part, I mean, some people take their knife to pop that down. Yes, those are his testicles. Ha 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 pop that off now I'm only going to show you sort of half of the crab I'm going to work out all the meat of the rest of this outside of the video but these are the lungs and the guts well those are the lungs this is the guts the uh, yellow stuff in there I don't know how good the GoPro is showing that inside but the yellow stuff in there is what we call mustard which is the fat very delicious now, I usually take this part and break it in half. And this is your back fin. This is how he swims. So that's your, your biggest inside muscle there. There's a big muscle up there by the claw too, obviously. Now I take this part, crack that in half. And then there's all these little, I guess, flakes of meat inside. And you just pull all those little flakes out. All this meat is so sweet and so delicious and you shouldn't miss any of it and with uh, a nice heavy crab like this the mustard is out of this world so I'm gonna try to do my best of eating this crab without smacking too many lips but you get the idea you crack all those little pieces apart and you clean out all the meat I worked hard to catch this crab and I don't want any of it to go to waste so then you get to your back fin side another little uh, leg muscles and sides pull all that out like I said you get all that any little piece now when you're eating crabs usually you're doing it around a table of people and all your your friends and your family and it's just an event you sit down you pick crabs you eat, drink beer and you just you just talk and have a good time but this is what a lot of people go for. This is the back fin. Now you can do this any which way, but let me uh, get that little bit of meat out of there. <clears throat> and this is this is all one solid. Well, I wouldn't say solid. It's got little flakes in it, but this is one huge muscle of 
deliciousness right here. That's where it's at. Now, if you ever get the chance to have blue crabs, do it. Absolutely do it. I'm gonna take this off so it stops showing off my boobies. So, crabs, at least the Baltimore way, are absolutely amazing. Uh, now you can get blue crabs all up and down the East Coast in Louisiana, but here in Baltimore we steam them with, with Old Bay and beer and vinegar and I've had them all the other ways, boiled and everything else, but the Maryland way is obviously the best to me. Now I'm going to enjoy the rest of this crab, but I hope this helped you somewhat. I'm having a, a, a kitty try to come help me now. Watch this. Come on, kitty. Get your whisker. Let me get your whisker. Meow. I wouldn't do that. So, I only did have this crab, but I mean, you just do that to the other half of the crab. I might actually save this for the wife. She's uh, running errands with my daughter right now. But that's how you, you pick and eat a blue crab. Take your time, enjoy it, and enjoy the company you're around. God bless, hope you enjoyed. See you next time.